I'm Chuck Paulson from Puffinware. In this video, we'll explore results and show how to quickly find other results, most related to the ones we like. First, let's look at columns in the search results. Clicking on any column header sorts results by that column. For example, we can sort results in the order as ranked by Google by clicking on the rank column. Or, we can sort in alphabetical order by clicking on the title. Or, we can sort by groups just by clicking on the group column. Each group of similar results has its own color. Now, let's go back to the Google rank order. Suppose we want to find more results related to Apache Corporation, which is rank number four. We simply mark that result by clicking on the mark checkbox, and immediately we see two other highly related results, which are rank number 61 and 78. And notice that we'd have to search way down the list of Google results in order to find those two. Now, let's right-click, unmark everything, go back to Google order, and do another example. Here's a result number six about Apache Indians. If we want to find other results about Apache Indians, we can mark this one, and then look for another result about Apache Indians, mark that one, and give I'm in a search a good idea of what we're looking for. After marking a few interesting results, it's a good idea to sort by groups and see if related groups also have interesting results in them. So if we sort by groups, we can see that group number 17 has a few related Apache results in it, and also group number 5 has some Apache Indian results in it. In this way, we can quickly find our interesting results. Now suppose we want to go to the web page of a result. We can either right-click it and choose the Go To menu item, or we can simply click on the URL. And here's our web page about the Apache Indians. Now, let's get out of this. Now, suppose we want to export these results so we can analyze them later. First, we'll sort them by relevance so we get the most interesting results on top. And then we can go over to the results menu and do export results as CSV file or control R. So we'll click on that. Results is fine. We'll click save and ask if we want to see them. We'll say yes. All right, here's the results exported to Excel. We can select the columns do an auto fit so we can see all the details. And here's the results about Apache, ordered by Apache Indians. Here's our relevance column. And we can see that if these are ranked in Google, we see here's number six that we started with. All these highly ranked results are way down the list in Google. But we've put them at the top because it says we're interested in Apache Indians. Let's get out of here. And go back to iMetaSearch. In the next video, we'll take a close look at the extracted words area and show how to explore words, how to find related people and websites, and also show how to refine our searches. Thanks for watching.